uh, the Conflict Resolution and Mediterranean Security Program. From where did you get to know about this program? Oh, on a recommendation from my father, he said to, when I was searching for graduate schools, to, uh, to get a look into the University of Malta. I looked into it, I applied, and after mulling it over with my other choices, thought this was the better decision. How was your experience studying and living in Malta? Oh, pretty good. Pretty good. Was the program as you expected? Well... Hard to say really because I ne haven't had any conflict analysis and resolution as my major, so uh, I was a uh, major in international relationship, so I didn't know what to expect. Uh, and well, what uh, the end result was is just like it didn't, it wasn't what I expected it to be. There was such a eclectic mix of uh, different ideas, topics regarding such a relatively broad spectrum, a broad topic of conflict resolution. So wasn't what I planned it out to be. What did you like most about your program? Well, it's the variety of, it's the variety of subject matters. There's all, they hope to make us a little bit more well-informed of everything, which is always nice. It, uh, a lot, it compelled us to, uh, to think about, to uh, expand our horizons and like research very broadly and deeply into the subject matters and above all else makes us want to raise, intelligence, raise our uh, intelligence and knowledge of our own volition. Why did you choose Malta to further your studies? Well, Malta is an interesting country. It always seems like you know, my other choice was the University of Tor Toronto, but Toronto was kind of a part of a homogeneous re region, but Malta, it's like at the crossroads of like every, of like a major uh, hotbed of, um, uh, you know, like politics international relations and conflict and just having this uh, perspective in the midst of it all allowed me to not only uh, to like expand my a good place to exp to broaden my horizons all over the uh, var was the weather to your liking with the exception of uh, the winter highly to my liking yes did you taste any Maltese food of course of course at my fair share of pastizzi at my fair share of ra rabbit fatira bread and trying to think of other other forms of cuisine how hospitable were the maltese people they were quite hospitable sometimes they're a bit sometimes uh, from my observation they were a bit brusque but overall they they've been pretty friendly to me they've been pretty uh they've been pretty helpful when need be and they've been approachable so it's they were, so they weren't so they weren't all bad. Do you recommend your course to your follow your friends? Oh yes, very, very much so. I mean, for I th I don't know they don't want I don't want to be quoted on this, but uh, for the amount for like one year about like under twenty thousand under twenty thousand U.S. dollars for one year and two uh, master's degrees at the end of it. Uh, in a very cosmopo place, cosmopolitan place with plenty of opportunities to uh, branch outward and look into, different, uh, look into different places and areas, yes, I would highly recommend it to my friends.